Hello YouTubers, this is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions and today we're going to do plastic screen protector versus glass screen protector. Hello guys, this is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions and it's always been a big myth on screen protectors plastic versus glass if you notice all my phones here I have glass screen protectors on each one of my phones my iPhone 6 Plus has the glass screen protector here uh, not full body but uh, has a glass screen protector here um, and my Sony Z Ultra has a glass screen protector on the front and a glass screen protector on the back along with a skin my Nexus 6 has a glass screen protector on the front and a skin on the back. There's always this big myth about screen protectors. Uh, most retail uh, phone stores would say, buy a phone and get a screen protector. And the first thing you do, they say you this. And I'm gonna tell you today, this is garbage. I would not recommend these screen protectors. You know, um, because what happens a lot is you put this screen protector on your phone, you drop your phone, right? You drop this phone, and the phone is going to look like this. See what I'm talking about? If you've seen the screenshots, they look terrible. And, you know, I see a lot of people walking around town with screens look like that. So let's get this myth out the way. The reason why you put this on here if for, to prevent scratches on your screen, most newer phones have Gorilla Glass 4, uh, Gorilla Glass, uh, Gr I'm sorry, Gorilla Glass 3, or Gorilla Glass 4. So if you have Gorilla Glass 3 or 4, your screen ain't gonna scratch too much. Uh, they really got coating on these screens and it, they won't scratch. So, what's the reason of putting this on? If you drop your phone with this plastic screen protector on it, the glass will break. Now, this is a glass screen protector, okay? So what happens is you put this glass screen protector on here, and if you drop this phone face first on this front, what happens, it will break the glass, it will break, break the screen protector. So basically all you have to do is just peel this off, get a new one on Amazon. Basically 30, 40 bucks. And you just put apply a new one on. But what if you break the screen with a plastic screen protector on it? It will break the screen. It will shatter this screen. And most retailers and third-party companies will charge you over a hundred bucks, sometimes two to three hundred dollars, to to fix your screen on your phone. I tell you, that definitely is not the way to go. But today, I want to give y'all guys. This is a myth. I would not buy these. This is nothing. You know, a lot of people would beg to differ. I might piss some people off. But I'm going to tell you, I guarantee you, a glass screen protector is a lot better than having this on here. Now you have to remember that you pay $600 to $700 for these phones. Now a lot of people say, no, I only paid with 99 cents. Listen, over a two-year contract, you will pay for this phone. These phones are $600 to $700. The iPhone 6 Plus. 130 the 128 gig version is over a thousand dollars so if you think you're only paying 299 199 and that's on contract remember these phones is very expensive and if you drop them it's like a paperweight remember glass screen protectors and I have one here and this is for my uh, uh, extra one for my Nexus 6. But here on my Nexus 6, I got an edge to edge, edge to edge screen protector, which is nice. 
see that. And so, and if you saw any of my previous videos, I just changed the glass screen protector on this phone because it cracked, I dropped it. So it broke the screen and I was able just to peel this off, put a new one on and voila, it's done. But if you have this thing on there and if you drop your phone, your glass will break. Now, it all depends. If you dropped it from a small distance and like that, it may not break. But if you drop this phone on hard concrete, I promise you, this glass will break. Now, I hear a lot of people say, wow, I wish I'd have known that before I went, bought this thing, $2 or $3 screen protectors and now my, now my glass is broken. So, take these, don't buy these. And look at that. And if you have this here, now let me give you an example of, a, of what I'm talking about. Now this screen, is this is a glass screen protector that's broken. Okay, so all I did was, when I broke this glass on my phone, I just peeled it off my phone and put a new one on. Nothing happened to the phone. I haven't broke a screen on my phone. I keep my phone naked, in so many words. I do not use cases. Well, I do on my Nexus 6. But uh, other than that, I do not use cases on my phone at all. Um, so in order to protect them, I put glass screen protectors on them. And it works out very well. Thank you very much for watching my videos. Leave me a comment below. This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. See you on the next video. Peace.